Welcome to Bible Story Time with Miss Jill. I am so excited to tell you the story today. I remember hearing this story when I was little, and I remember it because I'm the youngest in my family, so I always felt little. This, this story let me know that even though I was little, I could do big things. This is the story of David and Goliath. Goliath was a giant. Send a man to fight me, he told God's people. Fight the giant? Not us. The people were afraid. Then young David spoke up. I will face him because God is with me, he said. Brave David aimed his slingshot. The stone hit Goliath's head. The giant fell down and David won. God can help you to be brave, just like he helped David. So in this story, we have someone who's big. Who's the big person in this story? He's right here, Goliath. We see his face here. We see his feet over here. He was a big guy versus David, who is a little boy. See David down here in the white robe? Do you see who's angry in this picture? Goliath looks pretty angry, doesn't he? He is. He was a big, angry man. But who's smiling? I think David's smiling a little bit, yeah. But so are these soldiers over here. Soldiers were over here are smiling because David took care of Goliath for them. Do you see David's slingshot? It's tucked into the belt of his, actually we can see it two places. We can see it right here if he's holding it. And it's also over here in his belt. A slingshot, you use rocks, which we see on the ground next to David and you put the rock into the slingshot and you pull it, pull the rock back and it would go flying through the air. David knew how to use the slingshot because he was a shepherd and that's how he scared um, animals away from his sheep. Bad animals like tigers, no, probably a fox and things like that. So who fell down in the story? Goliath did, didn't he? I bet you could have some fun acting out this story. You have a sibling at home. One of you could be David, one could be Goliath, or maybe your mom or dad would play David and Goliath with you. Pretend to pull your slingshot back and then Goliath gets to fall on the ground. That could be fun, couldn't it? You could try that out. So remember, God helps you to be brave. God was with David when he needed to be brave, and God will be with you when you need to be brave. Now remember, how can we be brave? You can say, I can do this. Put on your brave face. It's not a sad face. It's not a happy face. It's a brave face. See if you can do that. Make a brave face. And remember, God is always with you. Be brave. Amen.